Hello everyone, this is CS1941. The video is going to teach you how to create a Solidity file. The step one, create the file. You can use the browser to search the remix ID first and save it to your favorite on your browser. Now we enter the browser, click the file icon on the left side and select the test folder, create a new folder. We name this folder hello world.sol and the blank file will open on the right hand side. Why sol? The SOL file is a script written in the Solidity scripting which is similar to JavaScript. It contains Solidity source code which is used to create smart contract for blockchain transaction. Step 2. Put the license. The most common one is copy and paste the MIT license. I will put below the video for you to copy. From 0 0.0. 6.8 Solidity will throw a warning if it is not there. So we rather not see warning from compiler. So we put a MIT here. Step 3. Put the compiler version. While I'm making this video, the compiler version is 0.8.14. So we set it to 0.8.14. And we do it by Typing programma solidity 0.8.14 semicolon. It depends on the compiler. If you want to set equal or greater version, we put a caret in front of the version. When you practice, it's better to set compiler version to specific number. And it's more important when you are deploying a contract to the mainnet. So we are remove the caret first in the practice. Step 4. Define the contract. So now we type the contract hello world curly brace. I'm going to define a string inside the contract hello world. So we do that by saying string public. Public means we have read access to this variable after we deploy the smart contract. We will name this variable my string. And we will set it equal to hello world semicolon. Now we click the solidity icon. Make sure the solidity version is matched the head over here. Mine is 0.8.14. So I select the 0.8.14. Once in compile with an arrow, then we click the Ethereum icon. You can't move on next day if there is an arrow in the script. Click the button, you will see the contract we deploy say hello world. It's not yet deployed on the mainnet. Now it's only deployed on the local blockchain and only happen in your browser. And we can expand the contract section and call a string on it and re returns the value hello world. 